Welcome to the Noonday Meditation with Wayne Vernon. The sinner's situation before God is represented in different ways in Scripture. Last time we were together, we explored the court analogy. And we concluded that sinners are guilty before God and condemned to die says the scripture but by the redemptive work of christ condemned sinner have been justified they have been made as if they did not sin we have been made as if we did not sin christ's righteousness is credited to us and our unrighteousness is removed but another theological term that i want us to consider today is the the, the term of reconciliation in this whole redemptive process man has been reconciled to god so let's talk about reconciliation Sinners have been reconciled to God through the atoning work of our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, but what exactly does that mean? It means that the enmity, that enmity that existed between God and the sinner has been abolished. And you see, because of man's rebellion, humankind has been estranged from the loving holy god who has now become angry like adam and eve sinners experience relational and social distance from god there is relational and social distance between humankind and their makeup uh, and this behavior has angered God and placed man under the wrath of Almighty God. Friends, the beauty though about the redemptive work of Christ is that God reconciles the world to himself through Jesus Christ. According to uh, 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and the verse 19. So man who has been separated from christ and from god but yet jesus acts radically says one writer in man's behalf uh, by doing for him what he could not do going for him where he could never have gone so loved ones the question is when we have such a great relationship, do you, do you treasure this restored relationship made possible by Jesus Christ? Do, 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 you, do you take it for granted or do you take it seriously? You know, is your approach the kind of nonchalant approach to to, to your relationship with, with Jesus or, or uh, is it intentional? Do you communicate with him on a daily basis or is it occasional? Is your relationship deep, a deep relationship or is it just a platonic relationship? Are you excited about your relationship with God? do you treasure it are you committed to keeping this relationship alive friends this relationship is to die for trust the word of god on that stay close to him keep it intimate you will be blessed may the grace of our lord jesus christ be with you amen Thank you for listening to the Noonday Meditation with Pastor Wayne Vernon. Please forward this study to your friends, your relatives, associates, neighbors, 
and all those persons in your social network. If you have a prayer request, please feel free to communicate with us and we will commit to supporting you in prayer. Until we meet again tomorrow, Shalom.